I Love Lucy is an iconic sitcom that had six seasons and 180 episodes. In the kaleidoscope of talented cast, there was one player whose relationship with the rest of the cast was less than harmonious. Stay tuned as we dive into the complex dynamics of this sitcom, unearthing a tale of friction behind the laughter. William Frawley, a quintessential cast member. William Clement Frawley was born February 26, 1887, in Burlington, Iowa. He began his career in vaudeville in 1914, alongside his then-wife Edna Louise Brote, in a comedy act known as Frawley and Louise. This stage partnership lasted until their divorce in 1927. Frawley also graced the Broadway stage multiple times. In 1916, he signed with Paramount Studios and starred in over 100 films over a span of 35 years, demonstrating his unwavering dedication to the entertainment industry. In 1951, when Frawley was 64 and found film role offers dwindling, he eagerly applied to play the role of Fred Mertz the curmudgeonly, stingy landlord in a new sitcom, I Love Lucy. Despite the apprehensions of CBS execs about Frawley's reputation for frequent drinking and instability, series stars Desi Arnaz and Lucille Ball were thrilled to have a seasoned movie actor join their cast. His professionalism shined through as he never came to work intoxicated and consistently delivered his lines flawlessly just after one reading. I Love Lucy debuted on CBS on October 15, 1951, and became a massive hit. It ran for six years with half-hour episodes, later morphing into hour-long specials from 1957 to 1960, rebranded as the Lucille Ball Desi Arnaz Show, and later the Lucy Desi Comedy Hour. Frawley's co-star was Vivian Vance, who played Ethel Mertz, his on-screen wife. Despite their convincing on-screen chemistry, the actors had a strained relationship off-screen, largely attributed to Vance's dissatisfaction with being paired with a man 22 years her senior. Frawley, having overheard Vance's complaints, took offense. He held a grudge that persisted throughout their time on the show. For his work on I Love Lucy, Frawley received five consecutive Emmy nominations for Outstanding Supporting Actor in a Comedy Series from 1953 to 57. His character, Fred Mertz, became a beloved figure in the world of television, hoping to cement the show as a defining feature of the cultural zeitgeist. Yet, despite his significant contributions to the show, his presence, as we've already hinted at, was not always appreciated behind the scenes. The tension between him and the rest of the cast was palpable, disrupting the harmony often seen in their on-screen interactions. This discord, in many ways, created a paradoxical environment, where a show so loved by many bore witness to frequent discord among its cast. Vance couldn't stand Frawley While the real-life couple of Lucille Ball and Desi Arnaz translated their personal rapport beautifully onto their on-screen characters, Lucy and Ricky Ricardo, the same can't be said for the other on-screen couple, Ethel and Fred Mertz. Contrary to the friendly and cooperative rapport you might assume, based on their performances, Vance and Frawley had quite a bit of contention behind the scenes. One of the main sources of discord between the two actors stemmed from their significant age gap. When I Love Lucy premiered, Vance was 42, while Frawley was 64. According to the book I Love Lucy, The Untold Story by Greg Oppenheimer, son of the show's producer and head writer Jess Oppenheimer, Vance found it disconcerting to be paired as the spouse of Frawley, whom she referred to as that old man. What began as Vance's internal displeasure morphed into an open feud when her comments reached Frawley. Offended by Vance's remarks, Frawley began to retaliate by suggesting lines for his character that portrayed Ethel in unflattering terms, such as having a, quote, figure like a sack full of doorknobs. This antagonism wasn't confined to the early days of the show, but continued throughout its six-season run. Some viewers have speculated that the lack of affection displayed between Ethel and Fred on the show may have been a reflection of the mutual disdain Vance and Frawley had for each other. Adding fuel to the fire, Vance was known to refer to her on-screen husband as Old Fat Freddy in the series. When the opportunity arose for Vance and Frawley to star in an I Love Lucy spinoff focused on Fred and Ethel, the discord between the two actors effectively quashed the project. Despite the potential for success and the financial incentives, including a hefty bonus for Vance, the offer was declined. This refusal can be attributed 
to Vance's strong desire not to work with Frawley again, providing further evidence of the deep-seated animosity she held for him. Strange Demands and Volatile Behavior William Frawley's persona on I Love Lucy as the gruff but lovable Fred Mertz was not far from his off-screen personality. His prickly demeanor, coupled with an unyielding attitude and alcoholism, often brought him into conflict with his fellow cast members and producers, exacerbating the difficulties of working with him. One of the first issues that arose was Frawley's insistence on including a unique clause in his contract, time off whenever the New York Yankees made it to the World Series. This unusual request demonstrated his disregard for the typical filming schedule and the potential inconvenience his absences might pose for the rest of the team. Alcoholism was another significant factor that impeded his professional relationships. His struggles with alcohol were well known within the industry, and his resulting unpredictability made him a risky colleague. His drinking habits likely fueled his aggressive demeanor and contributed to his reputation as a hothead. As an actor, he was notoriously difficult to work with due to his combative attitude. He often acted out and took matters into his own hands to right what he perceived as wrongs. This volatile and confrontational nature made him an intimidating presence on set, leading to a strained atmosphere that made just about everyone around him feel uncomfortable, to say the least. Frawley found some dignity after Lucy Following his memorable role in I Love Lucy, William Frawley went on to play another well-known character, co-starring with Fred McMurray in the 1960s series My Three Sons. However, to the public and the press, Frawley would always be recognized as Fred Mertz. Such was the power of this character that he was frequently called by his on-screen name, often being approached and asked about his old TV wife Ethel. Even though he had moved on to a new role, the shadow of Fred Mertz loomed large in his career. But Frawley didn't let typecasting diminish his good nature or his humor. When asked about his old TV wife, Ethel, his light-hearted reply was, she's home doing the laundry like she should. Frawley's role in My Three Sons provided him with a reprieve from the physical comedy and antics of I Love Lucy, Instead of having pies thrown in his face or dealing with chickens on stage, his biggest worry in My Three Sons was tripping over the family dog. Shot on the same production lot as I Love Lucy, the familiar surroundings and faces made the experience even more comfortable for the aging actor. With a note of relief, Frawley remarked on the dignified nature of his later role, saying, quote, Thank goodness we have a little dignity on this series. He saw My Three Sons as a more suitable environment for him at that stage of his career. Despite his professional troubles and personal challenges, Frawley did manage to build at least one lasting friendship in the industry with Desi Arnaz. Their bond endured until Frawley's death at 79, with Arnaz offering a heartfelt tribute, Buenos Noches Amigo, in a newspaper ad following Frawley's passing. Now it's time to hear from you. Who was your favorite character on I Love Lucy? Did you know that William Frawley and Vivian Vance hated each other so much? Let us know in the comments section below.